question 20. So we've been asked to work out the area of this non-right angle triangle. So we're going to be needing to use the formula half AB sin C. Now in order to use this we're going to need to know um, the lengths both sides of the known angle. So we know this length we're really going to need to know um, either work, work out this length here or alternatively we could work out this angle here and use these two sides here. In short you need to know side angle side. So I'm going to start off by using the sine rule to work out what this angle here is. I can use the sine rule because I have a pair. I have an angle and the opposite side. So using side angles, uh, using uh, the sine rule, I'm going to go and say that um, uh, sine A, so sine this angle here, so sine A over 36 equals sine 48 over 57. So just to go over that again, I've labeled it, I'm using the angles that we were given here, capital A, capital B, capital C, the opposite sides of the lowercase sides. This has given me an opportunity to work out what this angle is here, just using the sine rule. I'm working that through, I get angle A being 27.992, and therefore angle B, given angles in a triangle add up to 180, is going to be 104.007. So I now have got a side, the tr an angle and a side. So I can now use the sine rule, uh, not the sine rule, the area of a triangle rule, just in order for my diagram to tie in with the formula. I'm now going to re, uh, re-label my triangle uh, so I've got my angle being capital C. So this is now my capital C. That can remain as being little a, but this is my little b. So it's half times a, 36, times b, which is 57, times sin, 104.007, gives me 995.49 dot dot dot, which is 995 to 3 sig figs.